Praise the Lord, everyone. Brother Roop here, relaxing at home. I uh, volunteer at Houston Hospice, and uh, yesterday I met a, a really nice woman. She retired from the Army, and she was taking care of her uncle. Uh, she mentioned she had a large family, but uh, nobody wanted to visit him in his uh, last days in hospice care. And that was because he spent most of his life in prison or in a homeless shelter. But this lady, a niece, uh, she drove 200 miles to take care of him and be with him in his last days. Now that's what separates a Christian from a non-Christian. That kind of action. That kind of care. Um... That's, in the last days, that's our life, that's what Jesus is going to judge us on, is uh, how we treat other people. Do we ignore them? Do we take care of them? Uh, do we choose to love them or choose not to love them? Um, this lady here, she, uh, she didn't know her uncle very well because he was separated from society for a lot of his life are incapacitated from drugs. But she chose to love him anyway. She chose to take care of him anyway. And she said, um, if another family member needs her, she will drop everything and come and, and be with that loved one. Uh, the rest of her family doesn't feel that way, but she does, and that's why She's a Christian and the rest are not. And um, that's what separates a, a Christian from a non-Christian is how we treat others, especially those less fortunate than us and especially those of the least of us, as Jesus said. You want to worship me, um, take care of those that the least of us in society. And... Uh, I just was reflecting on that tonight, a couple of weeks before Christmas, and I um, thought I'd share it with you, of what a real Christian acts and does for other people. Thank you.